for today's vlog, I'm very excited because I'm doing this vlog about X-Files, which is my favorite thing. This is my file -y vlog, because I'm um, crazy super fan. Okay, um, I'm trying to think of, of where exactly to start because I have a lot a lot of things here to show you. I'm going to show you some of my favorite memorabilia. It's not all of it just because it would take way too long to try to show you all of the things that I have of X-Files. Oh, uh, wearing my X-Files shirt. Isn't it so pretty? I like the old X. They have newer X's for the movies and things. The, the X with the circle around it or whatnot, but I'm a fan of the big googly X. I love the old one, the original. Um, okay, so this is a magazine. This is the first x file magazine I ever got. Um, it's very worn. <laughs> I have some, some, some things that are kept in mint condition. This one's not because it's the first one I ever had, and I've read through it about a million times. It had, um, because it had the uh, episode guide in it for like the first four or five seasons. So I went through it and I would go through it and, and you know, see which episodes I'd seen, try to see, see them all so I could catch up with what had been shown and read all the articles about a million times. So this is my, my first one, so it means a lot to me, my first X-File. Uh, magazine that I got. I've got tons now. Um, and these are these are the snowbird versions of when they were in the Antarctic of the um, action figures. I have the I have the regular ones as well, the ones where they're in the suits. Um, but yes, little little tiny molders and skellies and um I know, I don't, I don't have, a lot of the stuff is out of the packages because, um, when I started collecting it, I was 13, so I wanted to play with them. <laughs> I wanted to set them up on, you know, um, my dresser and, and, you know, make them kiss and everything. It's awesome. So, yeah, I know, main condition stuff I don't have. I plan on trying to, you know, buy second ones to keep in in their packages, but I couldn't. I just couldn't keep them in packages. These I kept in the packages for almost a year until I took them out, but I eventually opened them. Molden Scully Barbie dolls. <laughs> the only Barbie dolls I kept. Um, I was a big Barbie doll fan anyway, so when these came out, I was like, oh, I need them. I, and I was so bummed because I had saved up like $40. They were like 70 some dollars at the store. And I had saved up like 40 bucks, which is a lot for, you know, a kid in in middle school. But um, it had gotten stolen. But So my mom knew how bad I felt about it, and she bought me them. Because she's awesome and nice to me. But yes, aren't they great? They don't look too much like Mulder and Scully. They just kind of look like Barbie, like, dressed up as Mulder and Scully. But they have little tiny badges and everything, so... I don't know. I was very happy with them. I, uh, I dressed, uh, why I took them out of the box. This is embarrassing, but it's great. At the same time, I, I put her in a wedding dress. Da, 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 da. I had to. I had to. But anyways, these are my, my Mulder and Scully Barbies. They are great. And, oh, to show what an uber geek fan I was, um, I have the card still, uh, my my X File official fan club membership card, and uh, I still remember the 15 digit number to it. I'm not going to recite it right now because it's it's silly, but I still remember it. But this was the card. This is my membership official fan club membership card. I got I got plenty of magazines that had the official logo on them and stuff. Alternate covers. It was all very exciting. <laughs> uh, so yeah, there's that. It's awesome. This is, 
I have all the seasons, of course. Of course I have all the seasons. This is the first season that I bought. And it's the special edition one. The one that costed a hundred dollars. <laughs> now you can get them all for like, you know, twenty, forty bucks. So it's like, uh uh, yeah, I spent a lot of money on this. I saved up for a long time to get this. Um but yes, this is the first one, special edition style. It's all pretty. Pretty pretty. But yes, I have all the seasons. Of course. And this is um let's see, what else do I Oh, yes, I have this card that some friends got to, got me. Check it out. It's awesome. That's awesome. <laughs> I love it. I love it. It's the greatest theme song ever. Let's see what else there is. This is the first book I have of the X-Files. The first X-Files book um, that I bought. Um, I have several now, but this is the first one I bought. Again, usually the first stuff that I have is pretty warm, just because I was so excited and read through it a million times. So, that's that. It's the official, official guide to the X-Files. Uh, then I, well, of course, of course, of course I have the Filey edition. I was so happy when they put that on there. I got so excited. I was like, oh my gosh, they put the Ultimate x Filey edition on here. I have to get the, the special edition one, so... Of I Want to Believe, which is the greatest, awesomest movie that I got to see the premiere of. Um, and here's a bookmark. Isn't this the greatest X-File bookmark? I have this calendar. Oh, calendar. Um, 2000 calendar. I have, I have a few other calendars. But this this is one of them. This is the one that's not hanging up. I have one that's hanging up because it had has um uh the middle picture was like a, a little poster. So I have it, it hanging hanging up in uh from the first person shooter episode, which is an amazing episode. Um let's see what else I have. Oh, I've got this which I got the the um day of the I Wanna Believe they were handing these out to people in line. Um, we were like eightieth in line. I'm going to have a separate vlog for just to talk about that day and, and I'll have pictures and stuff to illustrate because that day was so so amazing and so awesome. So I'll have a separate a separate vlog because I can't uh I can talk forever about this stuff and I don't want it to go too long. But this is this is um the the TV guide they were handing out to us all. This is, um, I try to keep it nice. It's, it's, um, the postcard that I got from writing them when I was, when I was like 13, 12 or 13. I, me and my friend, we wrote them, uh, fan mail, um, because they, they had an address in one of the books of where to write, and so I got, I got this back, and it's it's printed signed, you know, it's not really signed, it's printed signed, but I still really love it, and I hope to one day get it actually signed, because I think that would be like a funny kind of irony, um, but I've had that for years, and, and it's, it's awesome. Um, trying to think, you know, I've got tons of the comics, I don't have the first one, I have the second one though. But I don't have them with me, and I feel lazy right now to try to go sifting through stuff to find them. But uh, I have the, I've got the second one. I don't have the first one because I was really expensive, and I don't have the money yet. But I'll get the first one eventually. Uh, I got a bunch of them. I got some of them for like a dollar. It was really awesome because they had some at this one comic shop that I used to go to all the time. It moved. They sold their stock, and this guy didn't know what he had, so he put a bunch of them in the dollar bin, and they were, they were like, at least, you know, ten, twenty dollar comics, so I got, a, I got, like, five of them for a dollar, and it was great. I was like, yeah, this is awesome, and, um, 
I also have um, a bunch of the collector cards. I have like I've got some that are just collector cards from the show and then I have some that are actually the card game. Um, I also have um, I'm trying to think. I, I've got so much random X-Files stuff it's hard to keep track. Of. Oh I have um, a bunch of the prints. Um, really beautiful prints from um, the comic book covers without any of the writing on it. It's just the prints of the artwork. And I've got I've got a case of those those prints um, they did for the comic book art.